baby is already settled and appears to be happy. Right, yes. Wow, great mama. She's a keeper. Yeah. And they are about um, seven days old. They look really great. Everybody got their own tits. Yeah. Good mama. Proud of her. Yes. She had 12, but um, the next day we lost one. So now she only has 11. Um, most of them are girls or female. I probably had about three or four male that I need to cut. Well, I cut them about when they're two weeks old. See? There. They're all full belly, happy. Uh, other one wanna, wanna want some more. <laughs> right. Get it, little one. Yes. Oh. I build that divider right there. I put a hog wire, which is about four foot by sixteen foot long, four foot tall, sixteen foot wide. Oh no, baby, come back here! Don't go out there. Oh, apparently they climb out in the fence, goes to the other side. Oh, I hope our other pigs will not hurt them. Anyway, they can run. They're pigs. <laughs> Piglets. They're exploring their possibilities. That's all it is. Like any other animals. There. See, in the other side, I have two pigs there uh, big mama big mama one and uh, red taco red taco is our male pig a boar male boar pig that's him right there um we also raised them or him from the baby um Big Mama, are you hungry? Huh? Yeah. No. There you go. Hey, little ones. You're all seven days old. You should learn how to eat now. Yeah. They look healthy. We are blessed. And uh, we have beautiful piglets this time. Yeah, that color is my favorite. That one there, yes. That one. She is. Oh no, it's a male. Well, guess what? You are gonna be a lechon by December. Yeah. Yeah, that's a male. Also a male. There. Oh. Continue exploring. <laughs> Oh, where, Mama, where are the rest of your babies? Huh? There you go. Mama is teaching them how to root, how to be like a pig. See? Even though Mama has a lot of feeds in the trough, she still root around. I think it's a nature showing 
the little piglets how to survive even though they're already domesticated but then pig nature they have to root you have to mess up the dirt in their pen so there you go oh. Hey, Lichon! There's my Lichon, that one. The one with the brown spot in his um, back. There you go. We will fix him in a couple of days and he will grow nice and slow by December time. Ready for Lichon. Perfect size. I have plans for you guys. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh God. So this is Bams. Um, you are looking at Bams uh, pig farm. I can say pig farm because I have like two big mamas. That's this one. She had 11 piglets and I the other mama is over there she already had babies I sold them she had eight uh, on her first uh, birth she had eight babies so I sold it I put it in Craigslist and somebody bought all of them and and I have big red taco he's our boar there I need to separate them somehow since they are tearing apart my little shelter that I built for them See, it's just a DIY shelter just a recycled pouch from where we bought some food yeah and a little recycled tin so, I, my husband said it's growing actually pigs doesn't need a shelter they can survive without it it's just a matter of giving him food and water and then they will grow all right back to my little piglets here as you can see they are enjoying and see mama is teaching them how to eat but the other over, other one over there, she wants nanny. See, smart one. Yeah. Okay. Oh, the turn. Keep eating. I have big plans for you. Uh, there you go. Get it, girl. Get it, little one. Climb up there in the feed trough. There is a lot of food. All right. Babies is coming back. Yay. Mama is great. Yes, yeah, she knows how to take care of her babies. There you go. Oh, don't tell me you cannot go back. You went through the pin. You went through the wire. Better learn how to go back. Alright, there you go. Well, the tall one is a hog wire, or a bull wire. Uh, the square on the wire is a little bigger, that's why they can go through. But the other one, see, the bottom are really small. Uh, piglets cannot go through it. But that one in the middle. At the time I built my pin, I ran out of the uh, little uh, hag wire so I use the bowl wire we always keep them around pretty handy all right hey piglets come back there you go oh, there is mama trying to get water yeah I always uh, keep water in their corner with a little water hose dripping they eventually accumulate water and fill it up Mm-hmm, there. All right, got one 
two more left that haven't come back. Come on, oh, there you go, there you go, yay! <laughs> Happy family together. Yes, there you go. All right, you guys have a great day. Enjoy my featured uh, video for this week. And I hope you like it. And I'll see you next time. This is Bams. Thank you very much. Have a blessed day. Bye.